Alrighty guys, we're going to be doing a much requested video on how, this is going to be on Forex for all you Forex traders out there. There's going to be a tutorial on, whoa, that thing's going higher. Ooh, I'm about to take a look at GJ. But anyway, squirrel. <laughs> we're going to be taking a look at MT4 and the tutorial today is how to open up two MT4 platforms with the same broker. Um... And you might want to do this if you have two different accounts with the same broker. And uh, when you first install your uh, MetaTrader 4 or MetaTrader 5, you can only open up one. And there is a way to be able to open up two of them. And I'm about to show you how to do that now. We're going to be doing this example with MT4, FTMO. And it doesn't matter if you guys can see my account number there. Um, it doesn't really matter because this is a trial account. But... Uh, we're going to go ahead and close it. So go ahead and close your MT4 platform if you have it open. All right. If it's MT4, guys, you're going to go to Program Files times 86 and find it right there. There it is, FTMO MetaTrader 4. If you're using MT5, you're going to go to Program Files, just Program Files, not the one that says times 86, but the one that just says Program Files, and you will see it there. I have 5% online MetaTrader 5, FX Live Capital MetaTrader 5. There it is. And that's how you can get to it. It's going to be the same process for either one. We're going to be using uh, MT4. So we're going back to Program Files times 86. There it is, FTMO Tra MetaTrader 4. Let's say you have two FTMO accounts and you need to open up both of them. So you're going to go here. You're going to copy the, the contents here of this folder. All right, copy. Okay, you're going to go back to your Windows C drive here. Okay, you're going to make a new folder. And uh, I'm just going to, for the purpose of this tutorial, FTMO uh, second account test. All right, oh, shoot. Test. All right, so we're going to be using this as a test, FTMO second account test. Open it, open up the new folder, right click and paste. All right, guys, paste the new, uh, paste it in here. Okay. Now you're going to go to MetaTrader. I mean, uh, my, uh, sorry, it's, it's been a long day. Uh, Terminator.exe right here. Right click it, create shortcut. All right, all right. Uh, where's the shortcut? Here it is. On the shortcut, right click rename on the shortcut and you're going to name it get rid of where it says terminal do not erase where it says .exe very important don't erase that part now you're going to call it ftmo uh, second account second account boom all right now you can go ahead and uh, copy paste or cut and paste into your desktop wherever you want to put the shortcut you can even even right click and uh, click on pin to um, taskbar. Pin to taskbar, boom! It's down here. See it? Now we have uh, now we have two of them. All right. Let's go ahead and open up both both of them now. If you, I put a shortcut for it down here. Okay. Let's open up the second one right now. And here it comes take a while to open it because it's a fresh install in a way it's like a fresh and you in a way you installed it a second time and there it is boom see how it's all fresh bam there we go we have the ftmo second account we're actually gonna make this smaller so we can open up both of them so here's the ftmo second account let's go ahead and open the first one which i have the shortcut for it down here already and here's the original one that we copied the files from. Keep in mind when you copy it uh, and open it for the first time, it'll open up fresh. Look how fresh it looks. There's no account on it. You can actually uh, right click on account, log into trade account, log into your second account on your second. So now we have two of them, FTMO, FTMO, boom. Same thing with MT5, you do the exact same thing. All right, guys, that is how you run two MT4s or two MT5s at the same time on the same computer. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope it wasn't, I tried to explain it the best I could. I hope it wasn't too uh, 
difficult to to learn how to do you're basically just copying and pasting into a new folder all the uh, uh, installation files um, go ahead and comment on the comment section of the video if uh, if it, this helped you guys out if you guys have any questions thanks for watching the video and good luck in your trades guys and don't forget it's just like any other acquired skill guys a doctor goes 10 years, 8 to 10 years to learn how to be a doctor. To learn how to be a successful Forex trader might take you 8 to 10 years. It doesn't matter, guys. The beauty about Forex is you can do it anywhere around the world. As long as there's Wi-Fi, you could do it, guys. I recommend you guys uh, study up ICT, um, smart money concepts. It ha I have been doing this for about 8 years, guys. And... I'm telling you, I have not gotten uh, the results I always wanted until until I started doing until I start until I started watching the ICT Inner Circle Trader uh, uh, Guru on YouTube. His videos are free. He doesn't even sell a course. He just gives it to you for free. Um, I'm basically giving him free publicity, <laughs> but I'm telling you guys. Um, don't give up um, you can become a profitable trader it just takes time, guys it takes time because it's different your psychology um, you never use this type of psychology ever in your life right everybody's used to trading time for money and I'm telling you in the Forex market it doesn't matter how much time you put in it <laughs> well the only way you're gonna make money is to be on the right side of the trade but then, then you have to realize you can't always win, guys. Can't always win. You're going to lose some, all right? And when you start losing, uh, when you get in a losing streak, I recommend you guys bring down your risk level, right? If you get a loss, your next trade should be half the risk of your that you previously used. If you get another loss, use half of a half of a risk, uh, of the risk you first started with you get what I'm saying scale down your risk when you get in a losing streak all right and what ends up happening guys I know I'm ranting at this point but I really want to show you guys because I'm really excited what I've learned with ICT and ICT teaches this but anyway let's say uh, hold on I might have already lost some of your some of you guys <laughs> Like all I wanted to do was learn how to do it, how to copy MT4. But I'm just, I'm ranting at this point. So, for you guys that are sticking to the end of the video, this is going to be a good nugget for you guys. Let's say you're risking one percent, you get a winning trade, boom, that's your equity curve going up, right? Um, right. Let's say you lose, you get in a losing streak, right? You lose one percent. Okay, you lose one percent. Now what you're going to do, check this out, guys, check this out. Now what you're going to do is you're going to half your risk, right? You're risking 1%. Now you're only going to risk 0.5%. You lose that trade. Your equity curve is going to look like this. It's not going to go straight down because now you're risking only half of a percent. Your equity curve goes like this. Boom. This is a losing streak scenario, right? Now you're going to say, all right, I lost two trades in a row. I'm going to risk half of a half of a percent. Now uh the third losing trade is going to look like this that's your equity curve right this is uh the balance on your money now it's going to look like this half of a half of a percent see the big difference let's say you continue to lose half of a half a percent boom let's say you have another half of a half a percent look at that you're flatlining your your losses then you finally get back into the winning right so then you win half of a half a percent then you bring up the risk because you're winning now, right? Then it's half a percent, right? And let's say you you get into a winning streak now, one percent. See that, guys? You're flatlining. This is what you want to try to do, guys. Flatline, flatline your drawdown. Flatline when you get in a losing streak, and we all do, guys. I don't care how good you are at trading, you're gonna have a losing streak, right? But this is what you want to do when you have a losing streak. Then when you start winning again, you start bringing up your uh, percentage, right? Look how beautiful that is, guys. As opposed, what other gurus teach, 
is risk 1% all the time, right? So you get, boom, let's say you get two trades in a row, boom, that's your equity curve. Then you lose one, you lose two, you lose three times in a row, right? Look, you're way down here. And let's say you win one, lose one, right? So you're way the hell down here and you get in another, I mean, I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say here. This flat line equity curve and a drawdown is a lot better, a lot better than this crap. When you're just risking 1% all the time, you're going to be um, way down. When you when you get in a losing streak, man, it, your equity curve is going to like dip big time, like a dang waterfall, right? But if you use the technique that if you lose, if you get one loss, it's half of a percent. If you get a second loss, half of a half of a percent. And then you finally get back into your winning streak and you go back up and recover. It's a lot easier to recover when you use, when you scale down your risk after you start losing. We all get in the losing streak, guys. All right, that's enough of that ramble, guys. Just a little uh, extra nugget in there if you guys are Forex traders. And uh, hopefully the video helped you guys, first of all, to learn how to run two MT4s or two MT5s at the same time. And also how to flatline your equity curve. It doesn't matter what your strategy is. You could be using ICT. You could be using, I don't care who your mentor is. Uh, strict money management and risk management like this is what's going to keep you in the game. Right? When you push your edge, whatever your edge is, whatever your, um, um, your profitable strategy is. When you get into a drawdown, there's going to be some months where it just doesn't work. I don't care what your strategy is. Uh, we all go through it. We have one or two months out of the year. If we're lucky, sometimes we have more than that. Depends on your strategy. Where you go into drawdown. When you go into drawdown, you want to have a flat line equity curve right here, guys. That is a beautiful thing. And uh, if you guys want to check out my trading channel, it's uh, Luis El Patron. Um, I will post a link on the description of the video for the trading channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't... Don't give up on your dreams, guys. We can we can do this. We can become really profitable in Forex and trade it around the world and live the lifestyle we've always wanted to live. All right, guys, just don't give up, right? Unreasonable results require unreasonable effort. Okay, guys, like the doctor. He takes eight, 10 years to become a doctor to finally make 100, 200K, whatever they make. Same thing with a lawyer. It's a it's an acquired skill, guys. It's not going to be something. It's not going to be a quick rich scheme. It takes time. That's something I've learned from uh, people that have made it up there. They each one of them has told me. Each one of them has told me, this is an acquired skill. It's like playing at the highest level in the NBA, professional level. That's how it is. It's like playing in the highest. It's like fighting in the highest level in UFC. It takes time. Those, they start, those, those people, those fighters started when they were 15, 16. And some of them don't become champ until they're in their 30s, guys. Late 20s or 30s. Think about that. All right. Look at this as a business, not as a hobby or gambling. All right. If you use the right techniques, the right strategies, for example, flatlining your equity, your drawdown here, that'll keep you in the game. The stats say 95% of people lose 95% of their account in 95 days. <laughs> and the 95, 95, 95 rule. 95 days, and that, that's if you're lucky. Some There's, there's some traders out there that lose it in a week, over leverage their account, lose it in a week. But anyway, at this point, this video is getting really long, guys. I hope you guys had a good nugget there for risk management. And good luck uh, using multiple MT4s, MT5s very good um, thing to use when you start getting multiple let's say funded accounts with FTMO or your personal accounts whatever you guys are doing good luck in everything you're doing and I'll see you soon in the next video guys peace